summoned by its rightful owner, you are obligated to follow. I may have skipped over that chapter? <laughs> you haven't answered my question. The blades of Elysium were created to guide their sword bearer's dust. I was summoned to your side to ensure our balance was maintained between the souls within you. Ah, my old friend. Uh -huh. It's good to hear your voice once more. Wow. It has been a long time, Master. Wait just a second. How can you possibly know each other? My clan's been keeping the sword hidden for over 200 years. Master Grey Eyes has lived for a very long time, Fidget. Longer than any of you. So you were sent to keep an eye on me? To help you reach your true potential. Nothing more. Okay. No more questions. What's the plan? I have no more questions. What now? You must join us in the Moonblood Camp to the north in the Everdawn Basin. That isn't anywhere near the Everdawn Volcanoes, is it? They are one and the same, yes. Well, that's fantastic. <laughs> Volcanoes? Indeed. What a better place to hide than in the most volatile land in all the kingdom. Oh, I know. How about a peaceful meadow? Or a quiet forest? Or someplace that doesn't explode every ten minutes? Dust, your friend seems awfully tense. <laughs> no, I'm fine. Come on, let's go to the Blowy Up Mountains. Really, I'm serious. <laughs> you need to have more faith in me. I'll have faith in you when you have faith in yourself. How about it, huh? Who are you? Really? I'm dust. Exactly. I am dust. I am... I... Uh... You see? You still haven't figured it out yet! The lizard guy tells you right to your face, and you still don't know! I said I'm dust. Bridget, please calm down. You mustn't test your friend like this. I just... If I'm gonna follow you to the literal end of this world, I need to know who I'm following. And why. I understand, Fidget. You're right. I can't ask you to follow me. But I can. Fidget, you have stood by Dust's side for this entire journey. You have watched him save this world. How can you continue to doubt? I just don't get it. It doesn't matter who he thinks he is. He's dust. That's who he is. That's who I know. That's what I said. Fidget, please, I can't do this without you. I said I am dust. Can you, uh, can you repeat that? Oh my god, no. I said I can't do this without you. I'm sorry. I just, nobody's ever said that to me before. <laughs> and it won't be the last time, I assure you. Are you ready, Mithrarin? I am. Then we will meet you in the Everdawn Basin. I think I quite like that name. We'll see you there. See ya. Wow, what a fucking twist. We are two souls, forged as one. That's awesome. Also, the whole, the, uh, like, the, the, the uh, cutscene that played was fucking awesome. Did I get everything here? Uh, the answer to that would be no. Fuck, I missed one. Bollocks. Doesn't matter. Yeah. So I'm gonna go back. What? Oh! <gasps> they have news. General Gaius? What news, Commander? I did not want to believe it, but Cassius is working with the Moonbloods. He has turned against us. That will be for me to decide. Our paths will cross at the Moonblood camp. Of that I am certain. I will speak with him personally. Is that... wise? Our victory is all but assured, Commander. We outnumber them ten to one. We possess superior technology. And we have the element of surprise. But you don't have dust. This rogue element. He has already slain your own soldiers. What more proof do you need that he is a traitor to our cause? Cassius is hardly a rogue element, Commander. The Moonbloods have corrupted his mind. Forced him to commit these acts against us. Once I can speak with him. Once he remembers who he really is, I'm certain he will return to us. But... <clears throat> yes, sir. As you wish. Hmm. Now he'll have a... Cassius, my old friend. So long as you draw breath, I will do what I can to save your broken mind. I promise. Hmm. He's caring, which is weird. Wait. 
The Blackmore Mountains. I've missed somewhere. Wait, what? Where did I miss? Uh, what? I'm so confused. There's like somewhere that I missed, apparently. I don't see it anywhere. No. Wait a minute. The map. Okay, here we go. There are no openings. Anywhere. How have I only discovered 89%? Huh. What the fuck? That doesn't make any sense to me. There is literally nowhere else. Surely. Whatever. Either way. That was lucky. Yep. I'm just going to where the merchant is because I want to find the treasure. But I really do not see... Ah, oh, balls. Where... This, like, other map is. Because it's not in my view. That is for sure. Oh, wait. That's so useful. Nice. So there's treasure somewhere. Oh. There it is. There we go. And I now have 14 of those again. Yeah, 91. There is a map missing. Mm-hmm. It might be in the village. Like, maybe there's a house I can go into. That has a treasure chest. I would assume it's the house I've just been in. But I just didn't notice. Or something. I don't know. Yeah, I've got no idea. Up. Oh. Up. Oh, fuck. Bye! Insta-kill! I might as well make it through the cave. Oh. Yeah, maybe it's in the village. That's the only place I can think it being. In all fairness. Nope. Or not. Yeah, that would appear not true as well. Is there somewhere else I can search? Oh. Wait. Okay, that just, that doesn't lead anywhere. It looked like it did. Uh. There's nothing else here. And I don't get it. No, because it's like, I got the map. And there's nothing here. Like, all of the locations you go to, they're all, like, filled completely. None of them have a gap to the side of them. Which means there's no other place. Yeah, and everywhere, every spot on the map has been plundered. Huh. That's weird. That is. Either way, what we're gonna do... First, is go to Aurora Village. Um... And then into that challenge room, get the treasure. Uh, uh, screw it, we'll just go here. Yeah, get the treasure. Nice, 10,000. Wow. All dead. Woo! Get the treasure and then go to uh, Mudpot and see our friend Bopo. Oh yeah. Teleport! Boop. Doesn't that put me like right at- yeah. Perfect. The best place. And here we go. Simple. Oh. Ah, uh, no. Is it up here I can go then? Yes. It don't matter, because I'm, I'm leaving anyway. Fook! Uh, 
Thankfully, I can just jump out. <laughs> I will take no part in this. Or in that. So there's that. There we go. Yay, Aurora Village is completely finished. Woo! Also, instead of wasting a teleport stone, I may as well just do this. All the way to the bottom. Whoa. Just... Oh god. No! Douchebags! Just run away, run away, run away. Also do this. There we go. Perfect. Alright, now we can go to Mud Park. Also, we haven't found... What's his face? Yeah, all the... All the guys' sheep. We haven't found them. Which I keep forgetting. Wow. They aren't even worth my time. Can I go like... Oh. Oh, I need a bomb. Oh. Okay, there's nothing here. I didn't realise I needed a bomb. There must be a bomb nearby then. I must... There must be. Somewhere. Oh, unless there's a bomb in the village. No. I don't see no bomb. Uh, like, anywhere. Uh. It, that's where it will be. It will be behind that collection of crap. Or behind that rock that requires a bomb. Oh, wait. There's something over there, too. Oh. Well, there's that. Which did nothing, because I need a bomb. I don't know where the hell I find one, though. No, I'd like to find one. We'll go and see Bopo first. Um, yeah. I was about to say, I can't double jump, but no, I can. Oh, wait, what's this lead to? Oh, sheep! Oh. So we've gotten, I think, five of his sheep? It's not popped up saying, like, ready to turn in, or com quest ready, or whatever it says. Bopo! Where's Bopo? Oh, there he is. Dust, you did it! You brought snow! I did. I know how much it means to you, Bopo. Well, I don't have much to offer. Besides from this funny rock, it don't seem to do anything down here in Mudpot, but it looks pretty neat. Here, it's all yours. Thanks, Bopo. <laughs> we had our moment together, me and Pa. Taking a walk through the snow, building a fort, Watching all those flakes fall from the sky. I know none of it were real, but I'll always have this memory now, thanks to you. <laughs> I've just got to be strong now, for Mama. Thanks so much, Dust, for everything. No problem. You're welcome, little buddy. Oh, we're up here again. Now I can't enter the house. I got a rainbow residence gem. What? Jesus. Wait a minute. Oh my god, that was destructible. Holy crap. That's not everything in here either. The fuck? I can't believe that was destructible. There's nothing over here. No, that just leads down here. Yeah, which isn't useful. Yep. A rainbow one? I don't know what the hell that will be used for. Unless that means it can open up all of them. Oh. Opens all gem gates of the same colour. Well, maybe, I don't know. Maybe there are rainbow gates. In weird places. I don't know. I don't actually remember how big this place is. So there's more treasure. I can't drop through the bridge. 
There's nothing in your house, is there? Oh. There was, there was a key. Of course there was. Either way. No, that's just a random sheep. Yeah, either way. Once I find the teleporter, which I think will be very close by. I thought that was it then. Is this it? Oh yeah, here we go. Perfect. That's going to be the end of the session. And we're at 88%. My god. Jesus. Only 8%. Oh my god. Either way, that's going to be the end of the session. So as always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. And until next time, take care.